Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're talking about the bets you should make for UFC 302. And there's some pretty interesting ones. Of course, as always, I'm using Underdog Fantasy. Again, always use them. I'll be a sponsor someday. Maybe, 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 maybe. But you start all three here. And first, we're going to start with Absolute Locks. I have Alex Morono by finish at 1.2 multiplier. Absolutely finishing Nico Price. Nico Price is trash. And then, uh, da, 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 da. and then there's one more lock that I have, and that is oh yeah, uh, Dos Santos Alessi Zaleski Elizu. Elezu Zaleski Dos Santos. I have him by finish at two and a half. Now, interesting ones. I have Cesar Almeida, 45 and a half significant strikes. I think higher. And Grant Dawson, they think this fight is going to go to a decision. That's very possible, but I actually have him. Oh, there's no takedown thing. 30, 35 and a half significant strikes. I have that higher as well. That is three pick or four picks so far you can only do five and then another one is jake matthews it's a little bit of a risky one but i i like jake matthews by finish you could also do 39 and a half significant strikes which is it is very very likely actually we're going to switch that finish to 39 and a half significant strikes and thing i like with underdog is you could do a flex if you get five correct it's 30 time multiplier so like if you put a dollar you can win 30 or you can win 750 if you get four right if you miss the fifth one you get four right you get 750 of course you know you put there, there's a lot of variables you can do money wise but those are the picks that i'm most confident in and then some other ones you guys can do let's see so yeah, Alex Morono, I still like by finish. I think less than 10 minute fight time. It's just two and a half rounds. A round and a half, sorry. Or no, that's that's two rounds, 10 minutes. I, again, I like Alex Morono by finish. I like Basil, uh, Mickey Gall, actually 22 and a half strikes. That's an easy, easy get there. Damn easy. And then, and then another one is Andre Lima, mm, probably by finish. I like that one a lot. Uh, I actually think Mickey Gall beats Brazil. I know people aren't really gonna like that, but it is what it is. And then Jake Matthews could finish him as well, but I like the 39 and a half seven strikes. And then Grant Dawson could finish Joseph Selecki probably by submission I think that fight actually goes to a dis decision and then uh, let's see Romanoff could finish if he comes in uh, um, on weight on Saturday I really like him in that matchup really really like him so finishes two and a half fine or you could easily do a 17 and a half significant strikes I like that a lot Michael Olin Chechek, I think Kevin Holland destroys him. I like him by uh, by finish or uh, by knockout, but you also could do 43 and a half seven strikes. I don't think necessarily he hits that because he finishes them before that. I like him by finish. If you want to be a little bit risky, go submission. Maybe he hurts him, gets his. Uh, but what is that? Dars. Yeah, Dars choke that he gets. And then uh, Sean Strickland. 118 and a half stepping strikes I think it's crazy four rounds I think it's pretty fair if you want to be risky like I said you could go Pelo Costa by knockout 2.25 multiplier but I don't think Paulo wins this I like uh, Sean Strickland probably I'm gonna go 78 Point five five fantasy points, and then Dustin Poirier, Makachev. I do think Makachev ends up finding a finish and finding the win. But if you want to be risky, which submission is not a multiplier on this one, but thirty four and a half significant strikes, it's pretty easy. 
you want to be risky, go fin uh, finish is 0 0.7, knockout is 2, multiplier. That's a pretty easy one to go with, you know. And then now if you want to go, um, let's let's risk it. Dustin Poirier by knockout. Um, Kevin Holland by knockout. Or hit that one submission you know, submission or knockout, whichever one you want to do. And then uh, uh, Roman off by finish is two and a half, which is crazy, crazy. But maybe stay away from that one. Finish by Dos Santos. Um, where is it? Where is it? Alex Morono by finish is 1.2. And that four of them, that is the highest multiplier I can go, which is 100. So now just an easy, easy one. Let's let's do okay. So we got Romanoff. We're gonna do Romanoff a 17 and a half significant strikes. Now, that again, crazy multiplier, crazy up to 125. You could win if you get four right, you win about 50 bucks. Those are my picks, those are what I think. Let me know what you guys think. And as always, subscribe, like, comment. I'll see you at the next one. Peace.